So I've been going monkey crazy these past couple weeks and playing pretty much virtually every single monkey ball game there is known to man. And there are, there are some sneakers in, you know, in the series, I'm not gonna lie. And we're gonna talk about one of those sneakers. Um, it's called Super Monkey Ball 3D on the 3DS. Now, this is during a time where Monkey Ball as a series was actually going downhill. And a couple of the games prior to Monkey Ball 3D, um, they were pretty much getting mixed reviews. And the Monkey Ball as a series was pretty much almost dead. Super Monkey Ball 3D was actually a launch title for the 3DS, so we, we, I guess we gotta cut it off some slack since it is a launch title, but it's still shit, alright? So the core gameplay of this game is actually, it's just Monkey Ball, but it's just way too easy. The graphics look fine, it's, it's a fine game, and I'm not gonna lie to you, I actually did have fun playing this game, but it is just too easy. There's rails fucking everywhere. And pretty much the last level of the game is so easy, you can finish this game in about an hour or two if you know what you're doing. Now, as you can tell from my monkey crazy brain, I am a big fan of the series. And yes, I am. I'm like a super monkey fan, alright? And there is a worse monkey ball game other than this one. This is not the worst game. In fact, there was a monkey ball on the PSP, and that one ran like shit, so... Hopefully I can get a talk about that one. This isn't the worst Monkey Ball game. There was a worse one on the PSP, like I said. And from Metacritic, there were actual people who enjoyed the game for some reason. Um, yeah, I mean, if you put this game in front of like a five-year-old kid, they would probably love it. Now, unless you're like a really big fan of the series, I can't recommend for you to try this game because, well, it just sucks, right? It just sucks. However, there is more to this game. In fact, if you don't know Monkey Ball, there actually are these things called mini games, and it basically adds to the gameplay of Monkey Ball. It adds um, way more content to it. And a standard uh, Monkey Ball game has several of these mini games, um, and they're all, and most, pretty much all, are pretty fucking fun. They're really fun. Um, however, this game, Super Monkey Ball 3E, only has two, and they're shit, and they suck like really really suck they have nothing to do with monkey ball in any way they're just kind of like little games of their own that like suck right so first off you have monkey race which is a knockoff of mario kart and it's really shit and then you have monkey fight which is a knockoff of super smash bros and is very shit both of these are very clunky and feel really really cheap kind of like one of those wii games you find in like the clearance bin so overall, it isn't the worst thing in the world, but when it comes to the Monkey Ball series, it really is subpar. I mean, it's terrible, but I'll, just to be nice, I'll say it's subpar. So yeah, it, I really don't have anything else to say about this game, because really, there isn't anything else to say about this game. There barely is any content. And I mean barely any content. Um, Monkey Fight and Monkey Race suck ass, and I really don't see anyone putting their time into those two minigames. The core gameplay is fine, but it's just really easy and you'll finish it really quick so as a reminder this game was like forty dollars when it came out so imagine the poor poor soul that spent forty dollars full price on this game so let's take a moment of silence and you know appreciate those people that suffered from this forty dollar game so yeah uh, that's about it for this video and i hope you guys enjoyed it so yeah i'll see you guys next month, I guess.